part of your child's day, but a new study is shedding light on how beneficial it is to incorporate it every day in school as well. We are joined now with John Ashworth to talk about the findings from this new study. Thank you for being here. Happy Friday. Same to you. So let's talk about why was this study made, first of all. Well, we know that exercise helps kids think better and that it helps their brains, but most of that data was associational. So we didn't know if, you know, maybe kids who were fitter just were, could think better to begin with. So what they did was they created a study where they could follow kids for an entire year and put one group in exercise and one group not in exercise and look to see what happened. And what did happen? Well, it was interesting because what happened is both groups showed an improvement in their executive functioning in their brains, which is the part of the brain for kids that controls, uh, inhibits inappropriate behavior, helps them focus, helps them keep from getting distracted. Both groups showed improvement, but the kids who participated in this fitness program after school improved their fitness level, of course, but improved the executive functioning in their brain much more wow. significantly. So it's showing how important it is to incorporate in school. Right. And oh, a yeah. lot of schools are cutting back on that even, aren't they? Exactly. I mean, schools, they want to focus on math. They want to focus on science and these things that are really important. But if a kid can't concentrate, they're not going to be able to do those things. So cutting out physical activity and physical education is a really detrimental thing that is happening all over the country. Sure, absolutely. And there's some more information on this study right there on your screen that activities focus on fun. Right. So I know a lot of people will be wondering about this. Well, what did they do with mm -hmm. these kids? after school they had them for two hours they focused on fun they changed the activities frequently to keep it interesting for the kids they did exercise and then they would take a break for example they they did things to improve their motor skills too like dribbling a soccer ball and other fine motor skill sure. development that went for the whole school year and they ended up with about 70 minutes of physical activity a day which was the equivalent of about two miles per day for each kid. Wow and they did have you know this went over a couple of hours but they did have breaks in there and things like right. that so it wasn't just strenuous activity for 70 minutes. No they didn't just pound on the kids <laughs> yeah. for two hours no none of the kids would have taken that. It has to be fun has to keep them moving has to keep changing and be a variety of different things. All right. Thank you, John, for being here. If you'd like to learn more from John Ashworth, you can go to his blog. We have that on our website, NBC15.com. Just click on news links. We'll have a final check of your forecast right after the break.